Uh, hey everybody, welcome back to the working project title of my blind uh, exploration through Elden Ring. Because, uh, yeah, uh, unprompted, unplanned, un... I, so, yeah, so I, I can't even walk around this place without stuff happening. So, yeah, I was just poking around. I, I was, um, basically, I think, we, you know, we've built up a tiny battery of souls. I was thinking we should probably go buy those ashes from Wizard Man, uh, Renald. Uh, you know, just because, I don't know, it's hard not to collect ashes. I don't think I'm going to use these ones, but, but I, I, but I was on my way there, and, and did it, this wasn't here before, was it? Where did he go? There he is. Who are you? Is this a person? You an enemy? Aha! It's this guy again. Okay, I think it's the same guy that we've met three times, or it's, they're just all identical people. It's honestly impossible to tell, because you guys all look the same. Why is it always Thief? Yeah, it's you again. Hi. Yeah. Just keep running into you. Look at that. New patches. Grace Mimic. Oh, wow. Thanks so much. Yeah, these rule. So, all right. All right. I feel like the game is daring me to kill this guy. <laughs> he's he's a jerk. But um, but okay, whatever. Uh, I don't think I'm going to. I don't know. You know, I'm not a cold-blooded killer. It's just not in my it's not in my bones. But yeah, so let's go shop with shopping man because he's the shopping man with the shopping plan. Um, I think because again, I was doing a little prep here, and I did check before I noticed that guy. Uh, I think I have not, just barely not enough souls to buy him out. But, oh well, we'll, you know, use a rune or whatever. Nah, nah, nah. Yeah, I'm 500 short, but I can... Let's see here. Eh. Just eat one of these runes. It does say specifically what it's worth. 400? Uh, I think that's just a bit too little. Is there a 600? 800. Uh, there's a 200. I'll need a 4 and a 2. Inventory. And 200 use. Alright, where were we? Yeah. Oh, you have more things to say now. The battle art you've learned is of the Glintstone family. Oh. Ah, so that's what that is. They obeyed laws which contravened the Golden Order. Mm. So I'm told. Fun. Isn't it? Yeah. The Golden Order was pliable enough to absorb practices that contradicted itself in the past. With the Order broken, twisted, and in need of repair, such adaptability is more important now than ever. Hmm. Glintstone Pebble. Huh. Okay. And I'll take this too. Cool. You have anything else to say? Nope. You know anything else to sell? Nope. Alright, cool. So, uh, actually, speaking of which, uh, while I was off camera, I was also just looking through the things I've collected thus far, and, uh... Shoot, where did I notice it? It was when reading the descriptions of my spirits, I think. First of all, the jellyfish has a name. It's Aurelia. Okay. <laughs> that's that's cute. She's a girl jellyfish, apparently, and her name is Aurelia. Alright. Um But uh but yeah, it's this guy, Noble Sorcerer. He uh he's a spirit of a nobleman who wanted to go to Rhea Lucaria to learn Glintstone sorceries, but his talents weren't sufficient to be worthy of donning the stone. Stone crown, and it's noteworthy that he does look like all those stone crown people were fine. So they're from Rhea Lucaria, I guess. This is some like order of wizards who do some what appear apparently is slightly heretical magic or something, or did, and then stopped. Did the Glintstone sorcery stop working, and now they're only working again because the Golden Order is busted up or whatever? It's 
this is interesting. We're I feel like that between the between the, what he just said there and what I was just noticing in my inventory, I feel like I'm I'm starting to understand a little. At least now I understand why so many people are wearing those weird little stone crowns. Apparently, putting wearing a stone circlet is a signet of their of this like wizard order, or something. So that's neat. Um, okay, but now that we've more or less spent all of our runes, um, I mean, I guess I could fight this guy there for, but I don't, I don't intend to. This isn't the way I'm going. I've already gone that way. Uh, and I have an elevator to go there now, so let's go the safe way. Boop, 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 boop. Uh, but yeah, welcome back, folks. Yeah, this is, uh, this place is scary, and again, as I've said, this is, uh, this is blind exploration. I no no prep, no no previous knowledge. That's the whole idea. So, yeah, figuring out how to navigate this place safely seems to be semi safe. Like, cause God, killing those knights is not something I can do like reliably. Not a hundred percent of the time, anyway. I guess I'm gonna touch up here. I only got a little hurt by those birds, but again, I don't have to go that way, so all of that clearing doesn't matter. Um, I'm going this way. Because we killed the grafted scion, good for us. Didn't really give us anything. Uh, well, actually, you know what? I shouldn't speak so soon. It gave us tons of things. I mean, it, in spite of the fact that logistically speaking, it doesn't feel like we've progressed very much. In this place, we have gained a lot. I mean, we've gained this magic item, which is a huge deal. Oh my god, game changer. We can now turn into... In, we can basically turn invisible, or not really, but we can stealth we can do the box trick um and uh shoot i'm blanking on it now there was yes this iron wet blade also pretty important i'm pretty sure i mean it seems like now i can just give quality heavy or um dex affinity whatever you call that one um to any weapon even if i'm giving it um a battle art that's not for those so that's i mean that's not helpful to me right now but it's good uh, okay, so I've already cleared that out, and there's no reason to do it twice. So, yeah, I was kind of thinking about which way to go, and honestly, I think that the right way to go now is this way. I really think it is. I'm not sure if there's... Um, I mean, I kind of have other options if I exhaust my other roots up there. But, um, especially now that we're on a zero soul pro profile... I, I, I don't know if this guy throws something at me if I don't kill him or whatever. I just always feel nervous about leaving him up here when I'm dealing with this big clearing. Because, yeah, I'm going to deal with this big clearing. Um, I think I might actually want to clear it out now that I know where I am. I don't think I can't. Uh, I might summon for it, because apparently you can summon out there. Uh, yeah, I'm just trying to figure out if there's anything clever I want to do about navigating around all of those fucking weapons. Uh... But yeah, I think I might summon this guy. Why not, right? Uh, let's do it. Uh, let's drink the battle physic before we even get out there. Now let's just run. Go! Uh, and then get behind all the guns. Okay, and now do the summon. Dingling! Alright, you and me, night guy. Ow, shit. Let's get him. Yeah, you draw their fire. Damn it. Shit. Drink. Oh, yeah, that wind attack is a, uh, a little annoying. Ah, shit. Gotta let them really finish that combo, huh? Ah! Ha ha ha. Oof. Yeah, not unchallenging, but not undealable. These guys are just swarm tactics, man. They have, there are a lot of them. But, yeah, with my night guy over there just wrecking shit, I assume. I'm not really checking on him. <laughs> How you doing, night guy? You alright over there? You're fine. Let me just backstab all these people that are shooting you. You're welcome. Oh, alright, whatever. Ow, fuck! Ow, that's a full-on flamethrower. I've seen them use those before. I didn't know there was one in this area. Uh, damn it. I let myself get pretty hurt here. Bammo. Didn't get the counter for that one, for some reason. Uh, 
Uh, uh. Ow. A couple crossbow shots there. Okay, nobody's manning this flamethrower or what? I'm gonna go over this way. <laughs> Okay, this guy is buying me a lot of time. I can heal. Okay. Oh, come on. Good work, night guy. Are we done in here? Basically? Just that guy? Hey. <laughs> hey, you. Idiot. Alright. Can I use these things? No. Alright. They seem pretty effective. <laughs> they do a lot of damage. Uh, okay. Alright. So we cleared this area. Let's see what that gets us. There's got to be stuff here. Because we've snuck past here, but we've never actually cleared it. Doop -doop 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 -doop. A lot of items. That arcane's working for us. I mean, it's only 12, but... <laughs> I do like having my item find be above standard. That's nice. Makes me want to keep stacking it. I mean, the only thing that makes me want to kind of keep stacking is that this thing, for some reason, makes my spell scale with Arcane, the, the talisman I'm using right now, which is weird, because the, the, the dragon spells actually all require a lot more faith than Arcane anyway, so even if I was specking completely towards this dragon magic shit, no, 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 no. What's that? Is that another one of those lion guys? Am I in the place that dead ended me before? I thought I wasn't. No, what am I... What am I looking at? It's a broken statue. There's something else there. I'm sure of it. Yeah. What? What is that? What is that? What's that? What is that? Okay. Okay. That ain't normal. You're almost dead, Engval. That's a shame. Um, okay, well, we're not going that way just yet, then. Because uh, my intention was actually to go south and try to... <laughs> How? Why come? <laughs> what was that about? <laughs> my, my knight just smashed a barrel for some reason. That's interesting. Time for sniper. Okay, so you're saying that... Wooden great shield. From up here, probably... Maybe he can't find me? Can he not get up those stairs? So this is the cheese spot, if you're doing that. <gasps> Ooh, fire. Hmm. I wonder if I can unsummon Engval and stealth my way past him. Um, let's finish uh, clearing out this little clearing first, though, because he doesn't seem to be very alert. And as long as I'm staying on this side of the clearing, he doesn't seem to care about me. There's a door over there, but it's a bit close to him. I don't think I want to try to enter it. This place I haven't explored yet, though. Hmm. There's an item. Oh, and a guy. Item and a guy. Fire arrows. Not really much of an item. Alright, hmm. Well, no guts, no glory. I kind of want to fight that thing. Just, you know, know what it is. I'm, um, I'm a little bad up. I'm a little low on potions. That is a big room clear was not without breaking a sweat. But, uh, F it. We're learning things. And if we kill this guy, apparently we get a new fire. Oh, and there's a thing that I want him to smash. Okay. So are you just like a giant guy? What are you? Hey. Hi. <laughs> Good thing that's still on the fast switch. Wait. So yeah, smash this thing. Oh, you have a dog. How mean, you have a dog. Got it. Well, that's you, Engval, but oh well. Thank you for distracting him long enough for me to kill the dog. That was honestly very important. Uh, okay. Yeah, you're you're larger than the average thing. I'm going to drag you over here. 
And because I've only got two twenty three hundred souls, but that way this way if I drop him. Oh hey, come here. Coward. Oh, okay, you are coming. Uh-huh. So what kind of things do you do? Okay, you swing your big thing. Let me heal up. Because if I can use this terrain against you... Oopsie, I didn't. But I bet I can. Yeah, and then I can just heal up here. Yeah, I'm good. Uh, uh, yeah, uh-huh. Oh, fuck! Whoa, fuck! Okay. Everybody dancing with this axe guy. Dancing with this... Oh, he's a sword guy. Sword guy! Everybody's dancing with this sword guy. Yeah. Haha, uh. <laughs> you suck. Do I get iframes for that? That's not fair. I shouldn't. <laughs> There's like iframes in the heel. Uh, okay, I'm gonna need to drink a pot here, aren't I? Uh, okay. I'm just kind of watching him do things. He has that big three-hit combo, which is a little uh, and that kick is nothing though, right? I got, I got you. No. Yeah. Nope. Oh, damn it. Whoops. Too many. Ooh. Got a little greedy there, but I got gotcha. you. If I could have completed that combo, he would have been dead. All right. You're, you're fine. You're fine. That was fun. Uh, cool. Cool. Let's go get that fire. Heal up first, because uh, just because it looks like it's a safer run to a fire does not mean it's a safer run to a fire. No enough to know that. So, he, um, I kind of tried to fight around this thing for a little while, but he didn't smash it. What do I need to smash you open? What I've learned bef from previous is that I need a big heavy hitter. I thought that guy might be able to do it. Maybe if I'd gotten one of his kicks to be happened near it? Damn. Yeah, but there's glint stones in there or whatever smithing stones Ooh, magic magic picture okay go get fire first do people teleport into it or am i just going to get a new like location to find last time i touched a painting it ended up being less uh portentous than i thought it would be F bird monster don't aggro the bird monster it's looking right this way, but it doesn't... I assume it only attacks me if I go on the stairs there. Okay, I got the summoning pool. Yay. And, uh, not that I really care, but... Uh, yay. Nonetheless, it's an achievement. It's a thing I hadn't done before. Level 1 stones. Don't need those as much anymore, but I'll still take them. And this room has got to be safe, right? Because it's got a thingy in it. Yay! Lost Grace discovered. Yay! Woo. Making progress. Um, Alright. Because, yeah, this place is challenging. Uh, here's an elevator. Can I activate it? I can. Does this go back to where I was before, do we think? Maybe. Maybe. I don't think so. Based on the direction I've been traveling, though. I must have turned around. That would surprise me. Um, no, this is not where I was before. Whoopsie. Whoopsie day. I actually do want this elevator to be on the level that I'm on. Thank you. I don't want to send it down. I thought about jumping off of it as it was going down there, but I was like, no, that makes me nervous. <laughs> I like having my means of egress available. Uh, Glint guy, I hear you. Probably around that corner. Probably going to pull me into some sort of combat encounter that I'm... Yeah. Hello? Where are you? Are you around that corner? I hear you. You're very close. Is this a secret wall, perhaps? No? It sounds like you're right underneath me. 
Must be on the other side of this wall. Oh, I'm getting nervous though. What are you tricking me into, game? I hear something walking. I'm hearing a lot of things. Yeah, uh, oh, it's... It's a tiny jar man! All the jar men I've met before have been friendly. These ones I'm not sure about. Hello, tiny jar men. That's weird. I've never seen a sort of thing like you before. Well, I mean, I kind of have. Twice. The, the large-ish one, the one that's, like, bigger than me, but not big as a house, and then the one that's, that is big as a house. Are you guys hostile? Just because there's so many of you, I feel like you must be. You're not doing anything to me. Hello. Hello, little guys. What's up? You're cute. Hi. Hi. You looking at me? No? Do you, do you care that I exist? Can I just sort of walk by you? Oh, okay. It's coming towards me. Uh. Whoa! What the actual... Ah! 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 I didn't do anything! I didn't do a thing! It started it! I didn't even do anything! <laughs> oh, man. Hi. Well, I'm not going to fight you and your little babies at the same time. If you insist on fighting me, I will. But no, you're not going to follow me? I just feel bad. I kind of like you. You're cool. Whoa. I've only met one of your kind before, then, then it talked. It was nice. Have you gone mad like everybody else? What a shame. We're all mad here. Um. <laughs> but your AI can't deal with this door. Can you not fit through this door, sir? Aw. Okay. I mean, I guess you're kind of forcing me to kill you. Well. Oh, you're not that tough. Oh, poor thing. I don't, this, you know, I didn't want violence here. Oh, whatever. Ah! -ha! Okay. <laughs> well. You got one in. You got a hit in. Good for you. I'm gonna stand here and top up because you can't stop me. Uh, so yeah, I guess I'll let you do that again. And then I hit you. Yeah, that's, that's the safe way to do that. Slam your head in the ground again, please, sir. No, not, not that one. The other one. No, not, not that either. Come on. Slam your head. Well... I think that probably, you can't, yeah, there's, there's got to be a little recoil from that, right? Okay, there we go, that one, yeah. Oh, ew, you exploding grossness. Oh, Living jar shard, raw meat dumpling. So you are full of meat. I, can I learn something about these living jars now? Living jar shard, is that a... Crafting material, probably. Uh, I also noticed while I was going through my um, my crafting menu, actually, that I still can't make the, like, beast summoning blood urn because I don't have a, a ritual container or whatever. I thought it was jars, but it's not jars. It's, it's, it's like, ritual urns. I, uh, what the hell is that? I don't have that yet. But yeah, living jar shard. I found by killing living jars. I feel bad. A fragment of a living jar hardened after its death. Material used for crafting items. Such fragments command a high price due to the magical power locked within. This leaves living jars unfortunate targets for poachers. Aww. Aww. Well, I'm not going to kill the babies. This one with its little arms crossed. Is it... Gonna st none of them are going to talk or anything? They're just hanging out? I'm just going to go over here. Aww. I don't want to kill you guys. I'm sorry for killing your mama. I really am. Oh, I hope they're going to be okay. Oh, she she attacked me. <laughs> Aww. Aww, they're so cute. Aww, good luck, little jars. I hope the mom responds. <laughs> uh, oh, hey, there it is. There's the stupid thing. Just because I'm not sure there's not another trick around this next corner, haha. -ha. I'm gonna drop on top of you this way, haha. -ha. 
And then I'll get your ash that way. Don't make me kill those jars. Good. Storm caller. Oh, cool. That's what that's what my buddy's been doing. Um. So yeah. Speaking of which, if there is a trick around this corner, then probably the way to. Oh. Well, thank you, Ghost Man. There's also a thing over there. But probably the way to know would be to look from above over here. It looks safe. Um, but let's go get that item. I don't think I can make that jump, unfortunately. I mean, maybe I can, but let's not bother. Uh, is that an item, too? It is. Or it's a message. It's just a message. But still, that means I can get up there. Oh, Kukri. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Practice gratitude. No, don't do that. Uh, hmm. How do I get out there? I was just from there, right? But there's a wall here, right? Yeah. So, okay. So that's on the other side of this wall somewhere. Okay. Noted. Uh, well, let's go touch this other side of Grace. We're just back-to-backing him today. Woo. Drink, folks at home. You are doing this playthrough as a drinking game, right? I, mean, I can't tell you when what would be good times to drink for the drinking game because again, it's blind. But I don't know, something surely. Sights of Grace makes sense. Deaths, I guess. I have enough of those. And here I was planning to make this a perfectly deathless run. <laughs> I mean, that was never the plan, of course. Uh, so, hmm. How do you plan for that? So, hmm, I guess that's a boss wall or something. Interesting. Uh, I've definitely not explored this whole damn place, though. But cool. Okay, so I'm getting close to something or other. Uh, there's a giant over there. Just a normal giant, it would seem. Uh, he's got just a normal guy next to him. Where am I vis-a-vis -vis the castle right now? This is a secluded cell, is what you're calling this. And... This threshold does seem to go to the inner keep or whatever, so that's probably where the boss is. Oh, I forgot to take a looky-loo at it. Also, in the room where the, the grafted scion is, there's a great big cool painting of, I assume, Godric, I guess? He's like a big knight kingly guy with like a lion. He also, I think, probably is the first guy in our little boss montage in the opening. So, looks like he's our first proper end boss. Um... Well, end boss. Uh, but yeah, he's, that's how we're going to get our rune chart or whatever. But yeah, okay. So now I know this is here. Did I touch this? I didn't. Okay. Um, but now now I know that this is here. I'm going to go back because pretty sure the path forked. I wonder if she's still here. Did she, come to think of it, did she break a wall or something when she came out? Where did she come from? Okay, well, let's find out if she spawns again. You gonna spawn again, lady? Person? Fella? Did she break through a wall? Where did she even come from? She seems to just kind of materialize from nowhere. If I... If I aggro one of you little guys, is she gonna attack me? Yeah, here, come on. Give me a little... Oh. Does she... Oh no, she's not. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh god, that makes it feel so much worse. Um, but yeah, what? Did I miss something then? I hope I didn't. How did you? Where did she come from? Did she come from above? Anyway, I'm not gonna kill you, little guy. You're too cute, and too. I mean, seemingly harmless. You're 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 slow. I don't. Maybe you do a, just a ton of damage, but. I haven't found evading you to be in any way difficult, so... Okay, so I actually didn't even check. Is this door locked? It does not open from this side. What? Get the... Get the scope. Huh. Okay, it's outside out there. Oh, did I miss an item? No. Wait. Yes? No. So someone wrote a message on this. Something required ahead. I don't... Okay. Um, so, I still haven't rested, right? Good. So this area is still clear. Good. Um, because, yeah, I think I want to go the other way now. So, wow. Uh, there's a lot of stuff going on over there. Okay, so, yeah, that's what I was looking at. Wow, there's, like, a whole platforming bonanza going on out there. Uh, I don't even know how to get to it, though, so. Okay, so that way is guarded by bird. I think I want to try to go 
this away, though? Which I happen to know is guarded by all sorts of shit, including those exploding multi-crossbows. But, I don't know, I, yeah, I could have survived that, I just didn't. <laughs> um, I am, oof, yeah, I'm getting lower and lower on healing resources and shit right now, but... You guys didn't hear that? Really? You guys are terrible guards. Just terrible. Uh, I guess let's backstab this guy here. Kachunk. Oh, come on! No! No! Yes. Uh, I am still in some trouble. <laughs> ah, fuck. I don't think I traded with the guy, that guy. I think it was the wind attack that got me, right? Only because one of them I saw coming and the other one I didn't, so it'll feel better in my self-concept to know that it's the one I didn't see coming that got me there. I think it did. <laughs> um, ugh, alright. But yeah, that little combat didn't go as well as it did it the first time. <laughs> Oi, uh, so wait, which which one of these things does it dump me back at? Okay, so, right. Uh, getting a new side of grace does make it your current side of grace. I only doubted that because, again, I don't know, my brain invented a sight of grace. Oh, oh, so that means since I didn't rest, she didn't have a chance to respawn. She, oh, oh, I'm sure she responds then. Oh, please tell me she responds. <laughs> I need this for my conscience. Ah, uh, what? Hey, game. Now you're messing with me. Ba -da -ba. And we're back. Yeah, hmm. I don't know if it's something about Godric Castle specifically. Oh, I only want to say that because uh, <laughs> walking through the grafted scions room always seems to cause weird chokes. Um, but also, I don't know. You know, I did just get this thing fixed. It looks like some of the transfer might have gone weird or something. Because these crashes weren't so consistent before, were they? Uh oh. I guess hoping it's not a consistent problem. We'll, we'll uh, might have to do some troubleshooting between episodes. Um, for now, though, let's just carry on. Uh, yeah, I, I need to know. Does this, does this lady respawn? Hello? You gonna attack me, little guy? Oh, you're so cute. I just have to stand right in front of you, I think. Okay, yeah, she's just in the back. Okay, okay, she's just in the back. Okay. Okay. Good. Good. <laughs> I feel less bad about that. That's fine, then. Uh, I left the elevator downstairs? Did I really do that? How, where's the lever? Is there no lever up here? How do I... What? How did I do this? What? <laughs> There's no lever up here. Huh? I sent the elevator down somehow, and it can't be called back up somehow. Is that true? That's not usually a problem in these games. Come on. There's usually a lever. Is there no lever? There's no lever. How do, hmm? That's not a safe drop. It, this elevator was working before. <laughs> That's how I got up here. Oh, man. Uh, is the lever outside? Oh, it's outside. Okay. Okay. I was like, what? Is this a one-way elevator that's not a thing I've encountered before? I guess they could pull that on me. Oof. That was scary. Um. Okay. So, ooh. Please, no. Okay. Okay. I'm going to crank down my settings again or something. <laughs> Just a second. Hold on. And we're back. Uh, and we're back. Sorry, I think... I, anyway. Uh, yeah, uh, sorry, I didn't want to believe that I had to play this game on minimum settings. But that's what we're going to be doing for a little while. I don't know if it's because I've got the recording software going in the background or what. But anyway, this game is really having some jank. It keeps slowing down on me and that scares me. I don't want it to crash, so... Not again. So, we're going to do it this way, I guess. Um, so, we're coming at this from the back. Is big guy... Something that respawns. Yes? I think he might. Yeah, yeah, there he is. Um, okay. That's tricky, because I don't really want to fight him at the same time as I fight all those guys, so this time I need to pull him up here. I can't summon up here, interestingly. It's only down there. So that means I have to solo fight this guy, but that's fine, I can do it. Oh, right, he's got the dog, though. Can I kill the dog with fire, maybe? Fucking dog. That thing is honestly going to be a big deal. <laughs> it's going to really complicate this. Uh, Dragonfire will be your doom. 
Yeah. Yeah. I'm the dragon mage, bitch. Come get it. Yeah, so I'm going to have to have you on farm if I'm going to be able to oh, do this area. So let's learn it. Oh, wow. Okay. Wow, that went better the first time. <laughs> okay. Well, I mean, shit. <laughs> so be it. You have to have this guy on farm. Uh, I should have touched that second fire, though. That was, that was what I was saying shit about there. I think that we be at the farther fire. It's, it's still a safe walk, but yeah, I'm going to be over here. Uh, but yeah, I'm not going to go fight this boss until I've found my way back using the other path, I think. I guess I could just take on the boss now, but I don't know. I don't feel like I've explored this castle nearly thoroughly enough to be ready for its boss. We are... I mean, we're at about the halfway point, so if I, wanted, if I really thought I was going to try to beat this boss in this episode, I would start now, I guess. But we haven't even seen him yet. I'll probably end the episode by having a looky-loo at him. But probably he'll kill us, right? This castle has been so hard. This this is not going to be a first try boss. Let's get real. The boss at the doorway was like a dozen or more tries. Probably significantly more than that. Still haven't actually oh, gotten serious about trying to go back through these things and ah, edge it in like a counter or something. One of these days I might do that. i just have to edit and re-up them. Wouldn't be that big of a dilio. Right, so... To stop this, I think that I'm load gating when I walk through that elevator is what's going on there. And it's loading all of these people in the courtyard. And that's why that choked my game. So I'm going to start hopefully spawning from there. We'll make that less of a thing. Um, but yeah, fucking opening with the dragon fire works. Let's do it. Kills the dog. Does a little damage to him. Oh, do it now. Yeah, two toots is enough. And then I can refill... And I'm good. Sword. So, once again, you and me. So, yeah, that... Uh, yeah, you're, you're not that bad. I can... Ow, fuck. That fist. That's what got me last time, too. Oh! Not the fist! Aha, nice try. Ooh. I didn't need to dodge there. I don't know why I did. I knew I didn't. I was fine. Oh, yeah, you can be backstabbed. I was starting to think you couldn't. Wasn't... Ah. Okay. Oh, shit. Sip. Nope, wrong way. I meant to dodge kind of diagonally forward, and I dodged kind of diagonally back there. Oh, okay, I'm good. Shield's got it. Good shield. Love you, shield. Not too good for shield! Ugh. No. Damn it! Damn it. I keep getting greedy on this guy. Because sometimes he flinches. It's only like the first hit in a combo, though, and I shouldn't rely on it to get me another hit. It's interesting. It's an interesting problem. Huh. <sighs> Yeah, the weight ratios still aren't working for me. I've got to, I mean, I think, I'm hoping if I pump strength more. I don't, I don't know how the poise math in this game works. Frankly, poise math is always so arcane to me. I've never really understood it. But it's, it's incredibly important. Because I, I'd like to believe if I keep pumping strength and if I carry heavy enough weapons, um, I can not necessarily flinch my opponents with every strike or whatever, but I can at least rely on the fact that, like, if I hit them when their shield is up, I won't blanch. Because those those little those little moments of losing control are pretty important. They create the uh, the openings that can end a fight. Yeah, like that little moment there, important. Ow! Fuck. Whoa. Okay. You can move with that. I didn't know you could do that. Usually your fist, you don't. Ah. Change location. Yes. See there. That saved my life. Oh, no. Sip. Yeah, I kind of saw that coming. You reminded me of Doorman there. Oh, wow! You're, like, quite a fight. I like you. <laughs> gotcha. Uh, I like you. 
Omen Cleaver. Oh, hey, talking about heavy swords, eh? Oh, tell me more. Is it? It's not a great sword. Oh, what is it? It's a great foul, curved sword. Curved great sword. Yeah. Okay. Curved great swords aren't exactly my flavor usually, but strength D, Dex D. Hmm. Uh. Huh. You're cool though. Curved sword on tool of war. Warded to Omen. Is that you? The weapon is made to take advantage of brute strength. The pattern etched on the blade is reminiscent of a decorative malediction. Indeed, when bestowing a weapon, preparations must be made for taking it away. Huh. Spinning slash. Um. Okay. And it needs 19 strength, 16 dex. Probably not. Oh well. Nice to see some big swords around, though. Uh, so... What I was saying is I think I want to go that away. Although, I guess I am curious about this, too. It'll probably get me onto above the battlements here. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, let's let's check this out. Let's, let's check this out. Yeah, let's check this out. I'm curious. These birds aren't that scary, even when they can breathe fire. Come get me. Oh, I thought you were going to throw a barrel, but you're not. Oops. That was bad. Oh, fuck! You got me, bird! Kind of, damn it. <laughs> kind of lost track of my positioning there because of the wall. It wasn't... I thought I could side dodge, but I was right up against this thing. Eh. Ah. Okay. I guess I actually don't have to kill that guy and bird guy, right? I just realized I'm kind of I'm working against myself. Um, okay, well, let's explore bird way. Prioritize. Prioritize pending. Thinking before we act. Okay, so because I don't think I have to fight that guy and bird guy at the same time. I just kind of did both because I was curious about both. Um, okay, so we're going this way. So let's kill bird guy. We are going to do danger path, but... All these little side roads are interesting. We may as well get them while we're in the area. All right, that was clean. Uh, there's another one over there. I'm going to smash these exploding barrels, therefore. Because they do breathe fire. Do you throw a bomb at me? You don't seem to. You don't have a bomb. Um, what's this way? I don't even have to fight you to go this way. Whoa. Come on, game. Stay with me. Uh, there's a guy. Hello, guy. You're an axe guy? You gonna get up or what? Yeah, come on. You saw him. He got up with threatening intent. He reached for his axe. You all saw it. He had an axe. That's That was a very oblique uh, Bill Hicks reference. Didn't really... Don't think it was clear enough, so I thought I would just tell everybody what I was trying to do. Uh, the He had a gun bit. Anyway. I think it's about... Oh! Ow, fuck, Korea. No, it's about Iraq. Sorry. Uh. Okay, Jesus. Shoot your stupid thing. I should have just cast heal there. This guy's going to give me infinite time. Okay. Kya, that's fun. I'm strong. <laughs> Better these barriers are very bad. <laughs> you know, this is not a wood axe; it's a sword. <laughs> I shouldn't be able to cleave through three of them in a single blow. That guy's not dead. Come on. Pathetic ruse. Oh wait. No wait. Something's going on in there. Friend ahead. Yeah. God. Dog. Okay, well, I'm glad I came this way, I guess. Hi. Hello. Who are you? You were a fine warrior. Your only mistake was your choice of muster. Yeah. The winds lift you to a higher place. Oh, look at you killing people with honor and stuff. Hi. I'm Pending. Or Pendak, I believe is my character's name. <laughs> Hi. You killing knights? Me too. Sometimes. Well, you're not one of Godric's lot. Mm -mm. I am Nefeli Lee. A tarnished unwarrior like you. 
Cool. Nice barbarian gear. How utterly repellent this is. This grafting of Godric's ill befits a lord. He's tainted the very winds. Yeah. Yeah, he's he's a jerk. I agree. If you intend to challenge Godric, I ask you call upon me. Oh, okay. Yeah, cool. High five. Apologies. As fellow tarnished, we must each follow our own guidance. All right. Down whatever road takes us to the throne of Elden Lord. Not gonna sell me anything or anything. All right, bye. Uh, hey, there's an item over here. Excuse me, I'm just gonna. <laughs> My mighty legs destroyed all that furniture. I'm sorry, ladies. Nah, I mean. I'm sorry. That was objectifying. You can be a barbarian woman without having to be all red Sonia about it. I use it as a passive verb in this case. Um, okay, so... Hey, an item. Anyway, bye. Shit, forgot your name already. Does the map know? Yeah, Nephili Lu Warrior. Well, okay, I guess we'll bring her to the final fight. That's fun. Hey, and we're gonna have one more potion for it. Yes. Yes. That's big. Uh, oh, okay. So that's where the final fight is, too. So this is just another way around to it. Uh, which means that this giant is definitely optional. Um, but I probably don't want to skip him. These giants are fun. Uh, he's quite beatable, I'm sure. He does have two friends. Obviously, the smarter approach is from behind, because I think they're both on... Can't tell if those are flamethrowers or quad crossbows or whatever. But yeah, let's not do the giant fight while running through that. That would be silly. Okay, so that means we've explored in this direction, right? We found this person. Uh, we found the other walk up to the boss fight, but we're not going to use it because we already found the sneakier back way and unlocked the fire back there. Uh, we've killed this guy. We can drop down to where we came from, but there's nothing else to get to from up here. So yeah, we're done. Okay, so let's go touch the fire. Because uh, there's no reason to be hurt for this next bit. Because, again, those two things are different things. Okay, cool. Met a person. That's a thing. Did a thing. Uh, okay, we have 1,200 souls, so let's drop them all. Uh, <laughs> okay, once again, starting with the dragon fire. Glad we learned this spell, aren't we? Yes. It's cool, and it's sometimes useful. Pew! Burn! Burn, you trash. All right, because, yeah, I don't want to fight you with a dog. That that would be a nightmare. By yourself, you're hard. With a dog, I feel like I'm dead. Whoopsie. Menuing. Just standing in front of you and menuing and not doing a good job of it, even. Oh, okay, there we go. The pressure is helping me. Thank you. Nope, missed. Huh? Huh? Nice try. Whoop. Nice try again. Whoop. Oh, didn't get the backstab there. Too bad. There it is. No. Yeah, I got it. And I think I can finish you now. Uh, nope, not quite. Still gets the safe flinch on that, so I can rely on it as a hit, at least. You're dead. Okay, that was clean. Getting better at that guy. Um, He's a fun dance. I like him. That's the kind of fighting I like to do. Uh, okay. So, yeah, I think Night Guy is a, is a boon here. So, hmm. <clears throat> one of these times I've got to try to fucking get that guy to hit that thing. I, I swear to God he swung his sword around it. I don't know what hit he needs to be doing, you know? Is there some special ground slam he has? that I haven't, even, I haven't noticed anything like it. What do I need to do to break that open? I mean, he respawns, so I can keep coming back and trying in future, future days. Um... So, hey, yeah, you people. Me and my buddy Banish Knight Engval have something to say about how much you all suck and deserve to die. Uh, and we get to approach you from the back this time. That door over there, did we ever actually explore that? We'll see about that after we've killed all these people. Uh, where do we even begin? Uh, you up here so I don't have to jump later? Ooh, ow. Ow. Yeah, blow your horn. I want them all. Bring all of them. I need to build up a little endurance over here. Okay, there we go. Oof. 
That was a little rough. I'm just going to stand over here and heal for a second. You keep it up, Engval. <laughs> keep up the fight. <laughs> I believe in you. Ah. Oh, good. I did catch that. Uh, I'm probably going to aggro all these other people by killing you, though, huh? Oh, well. Not you. You. Yeah. Saw that. Nice try. No, that wasn't the counter. See, I don't know. Anyway. I wanted the counter there. Not now, though. Oh, oh boy. Ah, ah, ah. Oh, nice try. Sip. Oh, that was close. As long as I'm working with a corner, I can work you guys. No, wrong. Ah, yeah, don't use the block counter on these guys. It's when they have the sword, they're too fast for it. Is Engvall dead? I think he is. Poor guy. Oh, well. <laughs> it's hard to, like, teamwork with him. I guess I should have been working the same area as him. He doesn't, you know, he doesn't follow instructions. He just does his own thing. Which, I respect that. Neither do I. Okay, don't approach from the Bernie side. Approach from the non-Bernie side. Yeah. That's where they're vulnerable. Hey. Hey, you. This is for Engval. I mean, he was already dead, I think. He's a spirit. I'm not sure how that works. To be honest, I don't know. I dabble in realms that I do not comprehend. <laughs> Definitely, that would describe my whole deal. <laughs> dabbling, always dabbling, never comprehending. That's, that's, that's our brand over here. Uh, okay, I'm gonna just top up, mostly as an excuse to drink a Cerulean Tear. Glug, okay. And now it's just healing tears from here on out. Um, okay, so we've cleared this little area. Let's draw our weapon. And right, we didn't go in here because there's a painting for some reason. Oh, nobody? Alright. Hi, what's that? Examine. New prophecy painting. Huh, okay. So, is that this castle we're viewing from a distance? Oh boy, I'm gonna get to play this game again, I guess. Inventory, it'll be with the other painting, I assume, which is with the notes page, I think. Right at the end, yeah. Prophecy painting. Reminiscence of the painting Prophecy. Work of a wandering artist. Reminiscence of the painting Prophecy. The painter has been... Is said to have captured the landscape seen during the last moments of those welcome to death's embrace. The soul of the painter and vestiges of the dead last moments can be described. Okay, so it's the same description as the last one. I just need to find it again. Okay. 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 Hmm. So, hmm. Probably, hmm. This, that's the castle as viewed from probably the north side, I guess. Then. Oh, that's going to be tricky. That's a castle. The rocky outcropping is to the left from your perspective, so no, you're south of it? But what is that archway thing? Hmm. Okay, that might be in Lindgrave. We'll have to figure it out later, though. Okay, onward. If that is this castle, I'm not even totally sure. Oy. Again, I kind of just, like, I spent a long time looking for the last one and then kind of found it by mistake. Apparently, I am not super good at this game. <laughs> we'll see if I do better on this one. But I'll think about that later. For now, we're clearing out this area. I don't remember if it even gave me a unique item last time. Can't remember what it did give me. Give me something. Whoa, ow. Okay, one of you approach. Ow, fuck, no. Not one of you shoot projectiles. I forgot that you can do that. Well, I forget exactly, but... Wasn't thinking about it in that moment. And I should be. I always gonna be thinking about those projectiles. It's an annoying thing that you do. And you do do it. There it goes again. 
Oh, they break my block pretty good. Ow. Oh, okay. I'm using more health here than I'd like to. Okay. No block counters for you. You have a sword. Just hit. Okay. Whew. So, here we're getting to the place where I died. Uh, sorry, just peeking at the time. Okay. <laughs> I mean, luckily I don't have that many souls, right? Well, 4,000. I mean, oh well. I dropped that many in here before. Aha! Here we go. So keep moving. Do not step where the arrows have landed is the trick. We're good. Okay. Backstab the big one. Fuck, don't backstab anybody. Should have crawled. Don't back up out of this space or you'll die. Don't back up any more than this. Don't back up any more than this. Ha ha ha! Bitches. Let me heal up. Okay, and now we are definitely on the other side of that room. Yes. Which means Catman is over there. And I can summon again. I think. I think I got another summon in here. Yes, I do. Do I want Engval again? Uh, I might want Engval again. Oh, I can't afford him. Oh, can I afford anybody? Uh, surely. You guys. Posse. You're always there for me. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, noble posse. It's been a while. You're my cheapest, worstest summon, but I'll always love you. All right, let's, uh, uh you. War posse, to my side. Flinch the enemy. Flinch them to death. Draw their arrows. Draw all their arrows. Ah, yes. Do your no damage at all. And destroy in my name. Ha 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 ha. War posse. <laughs> I love you guys. What you got over there? I know you can't actually kill anything by yourself. So here I come. There you go. Okay. You guys are so good. <laughs> You're so worth it. Five dudes for no mana. Uh, okay, don't draw the lion thing this time. Okay, so the shots are going to start coming from above to the right here. So we want to stay over here. War Posse, I hope you're smart enough to figure that out. Yes, come on. Because uh, we are almost back to the door. And then, I don't know. That's just That proves a point to me, to myself, about how cool I am. Uh, see, now I, I'm just going to run past here. Not because I want to avoid this encounter, but because I want these uh, crossbows to not be shooting me. Yes, there is something over here. Cool. We're in. Golden rune. Is anybody going to follow me in here? No? Oh, ow! Well, the crossbow bolts will. That's, I mean, reasonable enough. <laughs> I'm going to touch this site because apparently I'm not so safe in here as I thought I might be. But yeah, nobody is following me, actually, like, with their bodies. That guy might be. I could just touch this site and heal, I guess. Cool, I found another location. Commoner's simple garb. Oh, hi, you startled me, too. <laughs> okay, can I maybe just turn you guys off? <laughs> I think I will. Yeah, there we go. Just because I don't... I, I think those crossbows are going to keep shooting me, and I don't have to fight through that door if that's happening. Uh, yay! All right. Good job, team. Um, we are starting to really pepper this place with fires, and now I'm pretty sure I can safely get home by just jumping over here. Also, what is this lever? Oh, man. Discoveries upon discoveries. What is this lever? What is this lever? I can't push it. What is this? What does this do? Surely something. It's the gate control? I guess that's... Oh, I see. I guess if I hadn't asked for the gate to be opened, I could open it now. Probably. 
But I just asked for it to be open, like a smart person. Why would I say no when someone's like, well, you want me to open the gate? Uh, okay, so that's where... Oh, hey, it's he's still there. You're still there. It's Hi. You. Hey. Hello. Glad to see you safe. So you're not the same guy as the other guy? Are you the new Patches? We haven't even found Patches' new shop. He allegedly has a new shop somewhere. I still don't know where he is. Um, what you got? Yay, you're a shop now. <laughs> okay. Thanks, new Patches. Bandit Manchettes. Is this, what? This is like an arm thing. Okay. So, so he's got a new Bandit outfit. I, what? Yeah, I guess it's, it's gloves, effectively. And Cestus. He's got the Cestus. Cestus? C I don't know. It's Greek, right? Um, <laughs> he's got some Stormhawk feathers, which apparently make arrows that do that whoosh, effect. <laughs> uh, okay. You don't actually have anything very good. You have a buckler. One and a half. Physical negation 61. Eh. It requires 13 decks. <laughs> Whatever. Still. I'll buy it. Uh, I don't think I even want this to taste this. Who uses this? I mean, some people do. It's a little too gimmicky for me. I'm not really into fist weapons. Um, the completionist in me wants it just for its own sake, but whatever. I don't think I care. Okay. You're not that hard to get to, anyway, so. Yeah. Thanks sure you do. Um, okay. Okay. So, hmm, okay, cool. So this guy's a shop now. I can now spawn up there and just drop down to him. <laughs> I can see the Grace's ripple from below. I wonder if that's because my settings are so bad. Uh, <laughs> cool. I can also leave, crucially, again. Hooray! We have the power to go home if we want to, but we're not gonna. Um, because instead, we're going to go die to the boss. Die to the boss. 4,000. <laughs> yeah, I guess that's where we're just going to throw at his feet. Well, you know what? Maybe I'm going to do a quick ba ba here and um, go throw some of these runes into one of my lower grade weapons or something. Because I've been thinking about leveling them up. Um, nah, whatever. It's only 4,000. You know what? Let's, let's spend it all at this shop here. Hi. Yeah, sure. Um... Sure, I'll take the Sastus, and I guess I'll take this bandit garb. Uh, I could get my boost item find things. I got the bandit garb. Give me the bandit pants. <laughs> okay, cool. There we go. Now we're empty of money. Yeah. Thanks. Uh, cause yeah, let's go, uh, let's go see the boss. Cause yeah, I don't think that we've completely, thoroughly explored this place. There was the, th like, a high, the upper floor up there. There were definitely a couple holes we couldn't get to. There's bits of roof we still haven't reached. Oh, you know what? I think that part of the other path, um, from, what's it called? The tower fire, rampart tower up here. I think that, that might be important, uh... But anyway, all, all of these things and more will be explored later. I, oh. Okay, so what you're going to watch me do now, damn it. <laughs> because I don't fast travel. Uh, and unfortunately, that's, yeah. yeah. there's no, like, convenient elevators from where I am now to where I've been. Uh, I've unlocked a lot of ways to go, but I haven't unlocked that from here this specific spot, particularly. So I'm going to need to go back up this path, I guess, to get there. Well, I just cleared most of this other path. I should just go back this way. Right? I haven't actually rested, so... Ah! Uh, no, I... Have I actually rested? I seem to be able to summon again. Oh, yeah, I did rest. I did rest. Okay. I forgot. Uh, glug. Um... So how am I going to get around without fast traveling, then? Is there, there's got to be a way to do this. I'm just going to have to lear use what I've learned about this place to get back to where I've been. Ah, did I never... Oh, I did. Okay. I thought this wasn't unlocked for some reason. 
Oof, sorry. All slowdowns here. And, oh. Huh! A hidden path! Well, I'm gonna check this out. Oh, and that's it. Right? Is that it? That's it. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, there was a hidden path. Oh, no! It's not it! That's not it. I hear something rustling. There's flags blowing in the wind. Fire grease. Oh, okay. I've seen this place from below, I think, right? Where am I now? Oh. Where am I now? Huh. This leads back out of the castle? It does. Okay. And over here is... I haven't been to the other side of that. Hmm. How do I get there? All right. Uh, well, as I've said, there's a lot of, like, minor poking around oh, that I'm going to want to be doing before I leave this place behind, I think. But for now, let's go see what the boss looks like, because I think that's enough for one episode, and I did just empty my uh, rune store kind of for that reason specifically. So, how best to get there? Do 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 I think I want to follow not Doom Path... Um, which makes it, well, uh, maybe we do just want to, yeah, bullshit run our way through Dune Path. I think we do. We could hide our way through Dune Path. Uh, uh, how much time do I have left in this episode? This is <laughs> turning what was supposed to be the end of the episode into kind of a long project. Uh-oh. Uh, l let me just, uh, let me just, just think about this. Hold on a second. I'm gonna pause recording. Yeah, okay, I think I'm just gonna do the back road way. This is kind of, hmm, it's a little frustrating. I'm trying to think about this. There's gotta be a cleverer way to do this, in part because this, this does matter. This is the walk up from the outside of the castle, right? So if I'm gonna come back here again, and again, I am, and I, again, I'm not gonna fast travel then either. Uh, so this is how you get to the other side of the wall, too, I think. Huh. I don't know if that's a safe drop. It honestly might be. Again, this game's pretty permissive with that. Oh, you know what? I can find out. Uh, let's find out. Use. That's... That's a sign that that would hurt, right? <laughs> that's what that sound means? What do we think? The fact that it shattered probably means that's a death drop. But I can probably drop him down there, I guess, is what that means. Hey, you. Remember me? It's been a while. You're the first of these weird birds I ever saw. Are you easier than them, or you just feel that way because I've fought you so many times? Uh, yeah, so here is how I can get down there, and let's try. There's more of these birds. It's okay, I'm not scared of them. A Roba bird. Well, oh, shit. That's bad. Is your friend gonna join this fight? I think he is. Yep. Yep, there he is. Okay, I'm good. Oh, missed it. <laughs> Birds. Cool. Hey, what can I say? I don't fast travel, so when I pass a location, I gotta, you know, I wanna go there. So, lucky you folks, this slip is going to be a little long. Because I'm going to make my way back to the boss, and yeah, I saw you there. I didn't know if you'd be the first one to attack or not. Nice try. Oh, there's a third one. Where'd he come from? Ow, ow! No, fuck, shit! Cock. Shit. Oh! You know what? In a backwards-y sort of way, because I haven't, I did, forgot to touch the fire up on that cliff over there, but that's kind of good, right? This will get me back somewhere where I can't get to right now. <laughs> right? Let's see if we can use this. Uh. Yeah, I think. I think so. Oh, no. Oh, shit. No, this was the last fire we touched. Oh, so that's the worst of both worlds. Oh, well. Okay. Well. I'm still going to explore that place. <laughs> Slightly long episode.
Checking out a new location. Dropped our souls there. Not turning back now. I mean, again, dropped nearly no souls there. Ah, <laughs> ah no. We're we're doing picking the castle clean next episode. I'm just going to run up to the boss. I'm going I'm to get us there and test him once. Just to see what he's like. Well, nah. I like to... I, sorry, I keep hemming and hawing about this. Uh, but yeah, let's give this episode a finale. I'm, I'm ready to end this episode. I'm going to touch the fire in case I die. Because it might happen. I do have to fight a couple of guys on these stairs now. But yeah, I've already unlocked this door. I'm trying to remember how much of a walk-up this is really going to be. I think it's just that bird and these three guys, basically, right? Oh, shit. Oh, no. <laughs> That's why you touched the fire. Yeah, so it's, again, not effortless. <laughs> Damn it, it's only the second time I've done that, though. That's, this is usually a pretty easy fight. Hey, <laughs> mm. it's not building my confidence for the boss. Um, yeah, this place is not easy to navigate. I mean, I guess I can use the fires now, if, if I was willing to play that way. You know, that's how it would have been in Dark Souls or whatever. Once you get a location, you get to and from it. I don't know. My, my, my rule against fast travel was to maintain the, the cohesiveness of the open world, right? It wasn't to make castles harder to navigate? I don't know. I don't know if this is... I don't know if my fatalism here is undermining ah, the good time I would be having. Should this, could, should this be less obnoxious getting around here? Ow. Because, you know, this is definitely... This is something I'm doing to myself. This part. Definitely. No other play, you know, if I wasn't eh, being so rules-based in this playthrough. Because, yeah, okay, so now I do technically have to get past these, like, bomb guys. Okay, yeah. But, again, it's after... Ow. After them was the knight. But I don't actually have to do the knight. Because I already have the key that the knight was guarding. So I just walk through the door, right? So, now it's basically just a walk-up. Like, now I, I need you guys to blow up these barrels, please. But then I just, yeah, I just run past. Kill this guy. Run past. Just, yeah, I don't even need to kill you. I just go this way. I take this ladder. Right? This is all pretty easy. Yeah. So, yeah, I'm not finding safe navigation routes around the castle exactly, but these are navigation routes. They work. Because, yeah, then I just go this way. Oh, nice try. Remember that ambush guy, apparently. Uh, then I just go this way. There is a knight here. Now, here's a thing. I feel like I never actually found the other end of this elevator, you know? I can just run by you, though, right? Because there's, like... A fire in an elevator over here, which is basically the hub I'm trying to get to. And I think if I touch this fire, I'll lose your aggro, right? Yeah, okay, we're good. Um, okay, okay. So, yeah, we can kind of get back to here, which feels to me like a foothold, because now I can just... Uh, thinking, thinking, take the elevator down... Ah, Jesus. This place. It's really hard on my box. Um, but yeah, still haven't found the other end of that elevator. There's still a lot more exploring to do in here. But now I can take this elevator down. Sorry, folks. I hope this isn't too boring. You're watching me learn this place? Again, to me, anyway, that feels like part of the... It's part of the adventure. Yeah. You know what? I'm all the more confident about this not fast traveling even inside boss bases now that I talk about it myself. Uh, okay, so I don't think I have to fight anybody. There's this guy. And then... Okay, so to get to where I want to be, I just need to basically dodge all this. Which is totes doable. Eh. Eh. I just go hard left. 
Uh, into this cover. I summon Banish Knight Engval. Have fun, Engval. I'm I'm not sticking around for this, but you have a good time. I go this way. <laughs> I just ignore this guy. Hype. Out. Whoa! I ignore you. God damn it! Don't make f make me look like a fool right now. Okay, and then, okay, I, I assume he won't come through that door. I probably have to kill his dog. Oh, he does come through the door! He comes through the door, ladies and gentlemen. He comes right in here, and he comes through that door to here. <laughs> okay, uh, that's too bad. That makes this frantic run-up a little bit less good. <laughs> Is there someone I can run past him to lose him there, though? Not really. Huh. Uh-oh. Okay. Maybe this frantic run-up isn't as functional as I thought it was. <laughs> uh. Huh. Okay. Trying again. Huh. There's gotta be a way to do that without waking him up then, right? Because if you don't lose him when you go through that doorway, then... Oh. I... Hmm. I feel like, you know, like... It, I, I'm not just looking for exploits here. I'm looking for what I consider to be kind of semi-intended routes. Usually Frum builds this stuff in, you know? Usually the run-up is doable once you've found the right route without combats. Um, and I'm wondering if... The, yeah, anyway, I don't know if I'm so outside of the intended play space because I'm not willing to fucking teleport in this place. Or if I'm just... Oops. Oh, whatever. It's flack enough. Good luck, War Posse. <laughs> You're just a distraction for the arrows anyway. Okay, but... Maybe if I go hard right here. Yeah, that's, that's how I do this. No, he still wakes up. He still wakes up? I think he still woke up there. I think he still woke up there? I'm actually not sure. Can I... Oh, uh, man, this slowdown. Can I just touch the fire before he... Wow, am I going to crash again? No, I'm not. Okay, can I just touch the fire before he gets to me and then we're, we're gravy? We can. Okay, we're good. We're gravy. Uh, I guess my souls are probably in here, right? Where did I drop them? Not that it really matters. There they are. Uh, okay, 600 souls, yay. So yeah, that door also not yet open. Lots of places still not yet explored. Gonna have to keep coming through this place and figuring it out. But, we've, uh, we found a lot of fires. We've, uh, I feel like we've got the larger shape of this place in my head now. There's where the jars live. Yeah, like I'm starting to, ow, god damn it. God damn it. Alright, yeah, I'm going to have to go under the hood in between episodes two and figure out how to stop this slowdown from happening. Sorry, folks. Can't be the most entertaining thing in the world to watch. Uh, but, what I know what will be entertaining is watching me just just get ruined by what is, I'm sure, a very hard boss. So let's go meet Godric the Grafted. Uh, I guess I'm going to armor up. Ba -ba. Oh, ba -da -ba. I almost forgot. We, we can add charges to flask, or I thought we could. Look at this. Three golden seeds? What? When did that happen? Ugh. So we don't actually have enough. Oh, well. Anyway. That's what that's going to have to be. Uh, oh, well. You guys can just watch me armor up. This doesn't take that long anymore. Um, okay, so yeah. There's my thingies. I think I'm going to go sword mode. Ooh, uh, no torch, of course, and then the heaviest damn armor we can, that we can slot, uh, oh, cool, we got a lot of new stuff, but, uh, the Godric Soldier Gauntlet is still the heaviest I've got. Okay, can I do that? Oh, now I'm heavy load, okay. Okay, I think this is probably good. Unslot these and unslot these because they're just a distraction in combat. Whew, um, he's pr well. Hmm, let's keep these on for now. We'll see. Okay. 
Oh boy, boss fighting time, boss fighting time, boss fighting time. Hi. Mighty dragon. Thou art a true born heir. Heir to what? Lend me thy strength, O Ah, oh, I already got dragon strength. Deliver me unto greater heights. Well, you don't have dragon strength yet? Basic. Okay. I command thee. I am the Lord of all that is golden. Um, I'm not golden. Oh, I see. You mean the golden light and stuff? Yeah, whatever. Godric the Grafted. Well, you've heard the name. You've speculated about how gross he would be. Now, come face to face with the big ugly mug of the man himself, Godric the Grafted. All right. So, wow. Oh, oh, oh no, you're you're stirring up a wind. I thought I, I thought I had you on your back foot for a second there. And I was like, what? Really? Ha 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 ha. Nice try. No, too early. Oh, okay. There was a double swing there. Oh. Ow! Backing up. Backing up. What are you doing? Okay, that just kept getting bigger on me, didn't it? Oh, fun move. He's sort of nimble, or at least he tumbles a lot more than you'd expect. Ah! Oh, wow, right in the face. Okay, I should have assumed there'd be an AoE on that. Come on. I'm used to these wind moves by now. I should be prepared for that. Uh-huh. Let's go over here. I don't like that corner anymore. Uh-huh. Eat light laser thing. Uh. How do you like holy magic, man? Let's see. Ow. You're all gross and undead and shit. Although I don't think you're like a person who walks in death, so something tells me that this is actually not going to be that effective against you. Oh no, this is going to get even bigger, isn't it? Yeah. Whoop. Uh. Uh huh. Whoa. Okay, that's a f whoa, fun combo. Two hits, haha. -ha. Uh, ow! Good hit. Yeah. That's a big AoE you have there. Quite the health bar, too. Not really pecking my way through. Ow, shit! Through you. Ow, Jesus, damn it. Uh. Oh wow, right on my face. Good job. You placed that right on top of me. Huh? Oh. oh okay, you knocked me down, but you didn't Ah Okay. Oh, come on. You really you're not gonna stick my foot on your butt or something? Come on. Put me on the corpse pile. Whew, well, that's a fun fight. He's interesting. Uh, he's got quite a health bar. I don't know if I'm using the wrong kind of weapon. Maybe he's a heavy armor guy and I should be using a pick. We'll see. But um, probably next episode we're going to try to pick this castle clean and then finish him off. Because that's, that's what we do. That's what we do. He thinks he's the lord of all that is golden. Well, then that makes him my enemy because I hate all that's golden. And I think that that's the main quest line, right? I'm getting it. Sure I am. See you next time, folks.